and let's move on to the next one, which is shipping and delivery. Here's where I made a big mistake with my first store. I like forgot to set this up and I was like saying I'm gonna give free shipping, but I actually forgot to set this up and I was charging like $70 for shipping and I was wondering why I'm not getting any sales. So make sure you actually um, set this up correctly. So um, I'm gonna click on manage rates right here and there's already kind of something set up by default, but what I'm gonna do is actually delete everything right here and set this up from scratch. Delete, delete. And so I'm gonna create a new shipping zone by clicking on create shipping zone on the bottom right. So let's say um, I mainly sell in the United States. So I'm gonna click, uh, so I'm gonna type in United States. Then I'm gonna choose the United States obviously click United States and done. And then I wanna add a rate for my United States customers. So click add rate. And like I said, I'm gonna um, use free shipping for this store right now. So I'm gonna um, just name this free shipping. Let's say this is like um, five to seven business days, shipping time. And I'm just gonna leave this at zero and then it automatically will be free shipping click done and then I'm going to add another rate let's say I have like an express shipping provider where um, they can deliver it in let's say one to three days so I'll add another rate let's say express shipping um, express shipping let's say one to three business days and let's say this would cost like um, let's say $12 Click done. And now we have two different rates that people can choose from. Also, if you wanna charge based on different carriers, you can choose this one and then it will auto generate from the carrier that you're using. Or um, you can also add conditions. So let's say I wanna um, charge free, I wanna give shipping for free in case the order price is more than $70 then it will be free shipping. So you can set this all up here. You can also do it based on weight right here, but you get what I mean. Okay, so the same thing I'm gonna also do with uh, the other zone. So I'm gonna create a new shipping zone for the other country. So I'm gonna click on rest of the world. Rest, uh, I don't think I need to type in something here. Click done, rest of the world, add rate. And let's say I only have free shipping for them. Um, let's say this is five to 12 business days, but it's free. Okay, done. Perfect, so now I have United States shipping with Express and free, and then free shipping for the rest of the world. Click save. And then let's move on.